Out here now, a senior at Foster High School in Richmond is this year's Rodeo Art Competition Grand Champion, beating out more than 4,000 wow. other entries. And with reason when you see it. Mia Huckman joins us now in studio. You are incredibly talented. Thank Congratulations. You. What inspired you to, to do such an intricate piece of art? Um, well, I've known about the rodeo art competition ever since I was in elementary school, uh -huh. so it's always been something that I've wanted to enter and do well in. And obviously this is my last year getting to do it, so I looked back at past winners and I decided what would ultimately be the best bet to get me to that first place spot, and that's what inspired my piece. And this was your fourth time yes. to enter, so fourth time is the charm. Tell us about what inspired this particular piece of artwork because it looks like a photograph. Yeah. It is so intricate. Was that a real person or someone you conjured um, up? Yes, it's a real photograph that my painting was based off of. I got it from my teacher. Nice. Um, this year, I, I just really wanted to win because, like I said, it's my last chance and it's something that I've wanted to do for a long time. So I took inspiration from what I'm good at painting, what I know as well at the rodeo art, and then I tried to fuse it together just to make something that I knew would place high. Yeah. Now, we haven't had the auction for the artwork yet. No. That's coming, but you've already had a piece that had a record high. Tell yes. us about that one. So last year, my painting Partners in Time won Reserve Grand Champion, which is basically second place. Um, and it sold for more than the Grand Champion piece of art for $265,000, <laughs> which was wow. the rodeo art, um, school art auction and record. And what was that? What did you draw then? That was also acrylic paint. It was. Wow. And so how much of that money do you get? Um, well, the amount that you get basically depends on what award you win, what lot number you are. So last year I got $19,000. That is huge. Do you do, do that towards school? Um, it's basically a check, so I can do whatever I want with it, okay. but I do plan to use it for college. <laughs> That's great. And you're going to continue your art, I understand, yes. in college with good reason. <laughs> yes. Tell us what your plans are when you graduate. Um, so after I graduate, I'm going to be attending Savannah College of Art and Design. I'm going to major in illustration and I hope in the future to have a career as a concept artist. Well, I think that, tell us more about that if someone doesn't know what a concept artist is. Um, a concept artist is basically, say that for a movie or a TV show, someone needs an idea for a set or a character or a prop, I would be the one to draw that, to design that. Yeah. Now, Mia, your, your dad is here today, yes. right? Yes. <laughs> now, when you, were, when you were growing up, for all the you know parents out there whose kids may be interested uh -huh. in art, did your parents ever say, oh, you can't make a living off of art? Yes. You need to shoot. <laughs> they did. <laughs> you need to choose something else. Um, you know, what would be your message for parents whose, whose children, you know, love art like you um, do? Honestly, I would just say keep trying and keep doing your best. And I think that if you keep working hard, then you'll be able to prove it to them eventually that this is right and it is something that is profitable. Wow, and now it's helping send you to college. That's yeah. huge. And I, it sounds like you really could get as much as you did last year. So mm -hmm. we could be talking $40,000 in all, right? I hope so. Yeah, or maybe even more. You never know. Yeah. Hopefully everyone if you're watching, bid up that auction. It's <laughs> coming up in March. It's going for as much as some of the livestock the yeah. art is nowadays. So that's incredible. Mia, and I was at a wine auction last night and it <laughs> went that some, some of it didn't go that yeah. high. So you're doing good, girl. <laughs> Keep up the good work. Thank you. Uh, best of luck to you. Thank you again. All right, we have a lot more to come, and we want to remind you, we happen to be your station for everything rodeo-related, so it's time to take out your phone. You can scan that QR code. It will take you to our website, fox26houston.com. There you'll find everything you need to know about the rodeo. You can also find the info on our Fox 26 app, which you can download and take with us as you head to the rodeo. Hey, we got you covered. It's free on Apple and Android devices. The rodeo runs through March 19th.